It's not an unusual sight. You sometimes see these able-bodied dog owners being led by their dogs in the park. The dog is the one charging ahead. The owner can't do anything but stumble behind. If you are having the same experience, it might be time to take the lead and be the leader of your pack. We often think it's only a sign that our dogs are very eager and enthusiastic, but it's actually a warning sign that our dog is asserting his dominance over us. If your dog thinks he is the leader of your pack, you are bound to experience obedience problems and behavioral issues that can get worse over time. Some of these issues are trivial, but some can have catastrophic results when taken for granted. If what you aspire is a blissful, uncomplicated life with your dog, then you must be the leader of the dog pack. It doesn't mean you have to be cold or tough. It only means being responsible and consistent. It starts by learning these few things. Being a dog's pack leader. We all know that dogs, like wolves, are pack animals, and every pack has one leader. The pack leader makes decisions from where to go on walks, how to behave appropriately, and what type of reactions are acceptable in different situations. Basically, pack leaders make all the decisions, and the dog instinctively follows his orders. Members of the dog pack. Dogs are hardwired to live in a pack, and a pack to him depends on your current living situation. If there are two of you in the house, then both of you are members of the pack. If you live with a family of four, he would treat everyone as members of the pack. Every pack has a leader, and it better be you than your dog. Dogs can't be the pack leader if they live with humans, in a household designed for humans. Dogs as pack leader can be problematic. It creates a bossy, needy, and stubborn behavior that will not be beneficial to you. Dogs of any breed will always assert to be the leader of the pack. You have to start your relationship with them by teaching them that you are the pack leader. You are the one in charge. Being in charge goes beyond who can yell the loudest, or who can spend more on food. You have to show dominance in various ways, and you need to be consistent about it. It would make our day if you would subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you don't miss new videos and can learn more about dogs. 3 Steps on Becoming the Pack Leader To start mastering the ways of being the pack leader, follow these three easy steps. 1. A no is a no. The first step in establishing a relationship with your dog, with you as the pack leader, is learning how to say no. Dogs do not think like humans, so they won't take it against you if you don't always give them what they want. 2. Be in control. Even the most assertive, normal dog will still listen to you when you try to show him who is in control. Start establishing control with food. Giving treats and letting them ask for food while you're on the table having dinner is a big no-no. This is one way of telling them that they are the boss, and that they're in control of your food. 3. Don't be cruel. Pack leaders are leaders for a reason. They are not leaders because they are the strongest and they can bully anyone they want. Pack leaders are reasonable and fair. Don't assert your dominance by using physical force that could hurt them significantly. These are some of the ways you can practice to become the pack leader. But, it's easier to learn by watching dog training videos. Training videos on being the pack leader. There are a lot of resources online that could help you become the leader of your dog pack. You can check Doggy Dan's website. He has some of the best online training videos on being the pack leader. These videos are high quality and easy to understand. He'll show you what to do in different situations where your dog is being problematic and exhibiting worrisome behavior. Being the pack leader, your dog must be able to relax while you are at home. If he acts as if he's switched on most of the time, that is him trying to be on pack leader duty. A subtle change in action makes all the difference in establishing control and becoming a good leader. There is more to being the leader of the pack than calling out a few commands. Thanks for watching the video. Do you want to be a good pack leader and stop your dog's behavioral problems for good? Check out the first link in the description and get your dog training video series absolutely free. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more dog related content. See you next time.